Innocent people are being locked up. The people that are detained are not criminals. Is the explosive growth of a system of immigrant detention centers that few Americans know anything about. In 1980, Ronald Reagan campaigned and won on a fear of immigrants. Soon after, private prison contracts were formed, with CCA receiving its first contract, profiting from locking up immigrants. In the past 20 years, CCA and GEO Group have made over $44 billion in revenue. They called it a recession-proof industry. The CCA businessmen knew that they could sell prisons just like you were selling cars, real estate, or hamburgers. The GEO Group is the world leader in the delivery of private correctional and detention management and other diversified services to federal, state, and local government agencies. GEO's success around the world has been achieved by our highly trained workforce. CCA is a owner-operator of jails, prison, detention centers in the United States. Uh, it's not for everybody to work in these type of facilities. One of the real perks of my job to see them working day in and day out, providing great service to our government partners. Breaking news on America's jails. The Justice Department planning to stop using private prisons, and that is sending the prison stock sharply lower. Corrections Corp of America down more than 40%. Private prisons will be making a comeback in the Trump administration. The day after Trump's victory, stock prices for prison companies skyrocketed. Stocks for private corrections company CoreCivic rose 43%, the biggest leap of any other company on the market. Geo Group rose 21%. I think there are several things that we could look forward to as a company in the next year, uh, first of which is immigration. They've increased the budget for immigration detention. And this number is only going to increase if we continue to allow private prisons to influence legislation as they've done. 